This is problem number four for section 3.6. And this problem it says find the derivative of the function. They give you q equals, we got fifth root of x to the seventh plus 2x. So we're going to have to use the chain rule in order to solve this. Now before we start, let's go ahead and define what our outside and our inside functions are. So we have q equal to the fifth root, we'll call it a u. And then that's u is going to equal x to the seventh plus 2x. So you can see that this function has been plugged into this function here. So we have an outside function, which is the fifth root of u, and the inside function, which is x to the seventh plus 2x. So we're going to go ahead and use the chain rule. And we have f prime, uh, which is the outside derivative of the outside function, times the derivative of the inside function. So we're going to have the derivative of the outside, which we'll call, let's actually rewrite this as x to the seventh plus 2x to the 1 fifth power. So when we do dq over dx, the derivative, we do the derivative of the outside, which will be 1 fifth x to the seventh plus 2x. We subtract one from that, that's a negative 4 fifths. Then we multiply this, so that's the derivative of the outside, that's what we did, we did the fifth root function. Derivative of the inside is in, then going to be 7 x to the 6th power plus 2 when you do this derivative here. So we have two things being multiplied times this. If we rearrange all that, let's move this to the bottom so we'd have, well, essentially on top we'll have 1 times 7x to the 6 plus 2, that's going to be the stuff on top, over, we have 5 in the denominator, and then this is in the denominator, which is x to the 7th plus 2x to the 4 fifths. So then we can rewrite this as 7x to the 6th plus 2, when we distribute that 1, it doesn't change anything, over 5x to the 7th plus 2x to the 4 fifths. Anytime I get a fractional um, fractional exponent that's not 1 half, I'll probably just leave it as so. It's more functional that way anyway. So this is the derivative of q, the derivative for q equals fifth root of x to the 7th plus 2x using the chain rule. 